Hi you guys, so I'm back with another haul and I actually picked up a couple of things from um, three different places. Um, I ordered some shadows uh, from Inglot. Um, I also ordered a couple of things from Coastal Scents and I got um, two pots from MAC. So first let me start off with um, Coastal Scents. Um, what I purchased was um, some black soap and um, I haven't tried this um, soap so I mean it comes in you know packaged and then this is what the soap looks like this is the black soap and I got the unscented it doesn't have a smell and it's actually let me see if you can see how soft it is so what you do is just pick pieces off, lather it up, and put it on your face. Um, and you also have to keep it in the plastic to keep it moist. Um, I also, I picked up some shea butter. And this is a little different than what I usually buy. I usually buy them in the um, little containers, but since I missed the Pan-African, um, festival that they had this year um, I had to order it um, I like this because it's soft it's really soft and what I've been doing and with my shea butter is I blended it with um, sweet almond oil and coconut oil and it actually has my face a little bit sm smoother and softer um, I also got two brushes from Coastal Scents. This is a blending brush and the bristles are soft and sort of stiff. So this is pretty good with blending. And this is a Destiny blender. And these are, the bristles are really soft. I have one of these and I really like this one. I also got some pots and this is the red hot pot and that's what it looks like and this is what it looks like on the skin and this is vibrant pink and that's the color And this is on dry skin. This is the color. And this is Vibrant Azalea Fuchsia. And that's what that one looks like. This one right here. And this is what the Azalea these two colors look real pretty together. And then I got one other hot pot. And this is deep gray. It looks blue, but it's actually purple. And this is the color. And this is how it looks sort of like a matte color. So, from um, MAC, I only got a couple of colors. This is Electra. And this is a real nice silver. Sometimes it looks blue when you um, put it on with the jumbo milk. And this is what it looks This is what it looks like. Let's see how it looks on my skin. That's a real pretty color. I don't know if it's a darkness of my skin, but it doesn't look silver. Sort of looks, I always think it's a blue. Light blue. This is Embark. I don't have a matte brown. And... 
that's the end mark okay so for the inglot about like seven shadows and the um, palette and this is a palette which I absolutely love and I like how the packaging I mean excuse the fingerprints but the packaging is really nice and what I mean by nice is that they don't just have it bubble wrapped like um, other places and the cool thing I like about this too is that one it's plexiglass and it doesn't look cheap and this is how the inside looks now comparing this to the MAC palette comparing this to the MAC palette I'd have to give the Inglot palette thumbs up I mean when you look at the MAC palette how it's I mean it's just plastic and you look at this this is more more thought about so I think what I'm going to do is just start buying the Inglot palettes and just put my MAC stuff in it because one it's less room because it's magnetized and then you can just stack them on top of each other um, and it just looks more elegant to me in my room than you know this plastic MAC palette but that's my opinion. eyeshadows come packaged in the little boxes and some are packaged in plastic which I don't know why but who cares and the one thing I do like about these is that first of all it took me a while to figure out how to open it um, so I was actually cu cutting them but there's film in the back of these and you just peel it off so if you're looking at this when you buy your ink light shadows you peel the back and off you don't cut it so let me show you the swatches that I have this is a nice matte purple and this is matte 377 and that's it I don't know why the purples look blue and the next color I think this is another matte color this is 382 and that's how that one looks energy is matte it's a very flat color and this is the AMC just number 50 and this has a little sparkles nice color red which online it sort of looks purp um, purp like a coral and that's that right there and the next color this is another matte this is 338 That's a nice bright turquoise for it to be matte. And that's that right there. This is another matte color and this is a real light lilac. And this is matte number 346. And that's the color. 
which I don't know if the camera's really picking up so it looks like a white but it's a really nice matte purple and that's how it looks on my skin this is a brown and this is matte B26 and it actually sort of looks like the Embark that I just bought so let's see that's really dark yeah that's dark I'm allowed to play with this one and last color that I have is another matte and this is like a peach And this is matte 352. And that's what it looks like. It's actually sort of chalky. Yep, it's very chalky. And that's what that color looks like. 